Passive recruitment. So I'm guessing that you don't really need any help with recruitment. You probably find it really easy actually to recruit people. Yeah, I wish that were the case for all of us. And so the world of recruitment is an interesting one. There's obviously recruitment agencies that are out there. You may be one. Um, but these are uh, companies that we've had to come to rely on. And actually, I'm not saying that we shouldn't rely on those guys, and they produce an added value here, which I want to make sure that I'm really clear about, which you won't get from what I'm about to go on and say. But what you will get from what I'm about to go on and say is perhaps more interest in your brand in terms of encouraging people to submit their CVs to you or tell you why they want to work for you. So on my own uh, company website, there's a, a video which I created called A Day in the Life of Optics. Now we're an agency and I get the, you know, we, we live an agency life, we've got silly furniture, we've got a pool table and a ping pong table and stuff that makes it quite interesting to create a video like this. But actually a lot of that video was just about going around the staff and talking to them and, you know, just showing that we're a laid back casual environment to come and work in. And that video has created or it attracted more CVs to my business than anything else that I've ever done in terms of recruitment. And that's what I would call passive recruitment. It's, it's putting things onto your site which attract people to your business. And I do think there's a huge opportunity here. Far too many people, people we work with, who come and get websites from us, they start off by thinking, let's have a vacancies page where we have a load of boring jobs on it and don't actually tell us anything about the business at all. So move away from that to doing things that show off the personality of your company. Um, that's obviously if it has one, I'm sure it does, but can you create something which attracts people to your company more? Because the cost of recruitment is high, right? And I, as I said, I'm not doing a disservice to the recruitment agents. Sometimes they are very, very important people in this mix because they take away the pain of looking for all of these things. But I'm guessing if you're a very small business, sometimes that can be overly costly for you. So this is a way of kind of attracting people to your business. People will share this kind of stuff on social media and you will have more opportunities to get in front of potential candidates than you ever had before. Videos, benefits, um, office environment, the kind of things that, you know, laid back, flexible working hours, all of these kind of things. If you do them, show them off please, it will change your recruitment drive.